Hi, welcome to your digital library. Your teacher librarians are here to help. This tutorial focuses on how to log into ProQuest, an academic database provided to you by the state of California. You can find ProQuest on yourdigitallibrary.org and don't forget to follow us on Instagram at your underscore digital library. The essential questions for this tutorial are, how do I log into ProQuest? How can I use ProQuest? And how do I access the articles? The skills that you will learn in this tutorial meet multiple standards across the curriculum. Those standards include the American Association of School Library Standards, College and Career Readiness Standards, International Society for Technology and Education Standards for Students, and Standards for Career Ready Practice. ProQuest Academic Databases offer six different platforms for you to explore, such as Culturegrams, which offers unique, concise, and reliable cultural information, multimedia, and statistics about countries around the world. There's also eLibrary, a massive collection of multidisciplinary, periodical, and digital media content. ProQuest, the unified platform that makes all of this possible. ProQuest Research Companion, which allows you to practice your academic skills and learn the ins and outs of academic research. SIRS Discover, which allows younger researchers to explore various collections of curated material. And SIRS Issues Researcher, which is a pro-con database that meets the research needs of students in all of their classes. By the end of this tutorial, you will be able to log into ProQuest, use ProQuest for your academic and personal research, and view the articles offered by the ProQuest databases. We begin your exploration at yourdigitallibrary.org. Once you have landed on your digital library, we're going to scroll down through the reading resources down to where it says Academic Databases, and we will choose ProQuest. Please remember that all of the login information can be found on this simple slide. Because we will be using ProQuest, our initial login for username and password will be Oxnard Union, all lowercase. Now that I reviewed my login information, I want to go ahead and sign into ProQuest. Now that I have logged into ProQuest using Oxnard Union, Oxnard Union, all lowercase, I can explore the different databases that are available. Culturegrams, as mentioned, allow you, allows you to explore different cultures from around the world. And we have World Edition, Kids Edition, States Edition, and Providence's Edition. Again, these are ways to explore all that there is to know about culture around the globe. Be sure to explore all of the different databases. For now, I'm going to take us into SIRS Issues Researcher so we can explore a little bit more. In all of the ProQuest databases, they are nicely laid out with tiles for you to get an, a simple grasp of what the database has to offer. Since this is a ProCon database, it gives you specific issues that are popular and trending and provide both sides of that argument. If I want to add and personalize this experience, I can log in with my school Google account so that I can share 
cite, and save articles. Let's take a peek at one of these tiles. In this portal about the coronavirus, I can see what contents there are, viewpoints, look at critical questions, and see a timeline. If I continue to scroll down, I will notice those elements. I can see the viewpoints and read the different articles about that viewpoint. I even can download a research guide to help me move through this difficult topic. And I can see the critical questions that I want to explore as I'm reading. And it provides a helpful timeline about the coronavirus. If this is really helpful to me, I can always save it to my Google Drive, cite it, print it, or email it to myself. This is an extremely helpful tool when doing any sort of research for any class or your own personal interest. Thank you very much, Savvy Scholars, for listening to this tutorial. I hope you find ProQuest extremely useful for yourself, for both in, your, in school and your personal learning. Please reach out to your teacher librarians if you need more help. And don't forget, you can find all of this on yourdigitallibrary.org and follow us on Instagram at Your Digital Library. If you want to contact us directly, here is our information.